Yo, doing a real quick video, the Nike on air series. I'm trying to make sure I get these in because I've had them several times. I just didn't get around to doing the video, so I'm just getting it in real quick and doing these now. Um, so let's look at the box. It's a gloss box, unlike any um, Air Max 97 we typically see, which comes in a red Nike sportswear box. This one is the black Nike on air. And um, big difference in the pricing as far as the um, Air Max 97 is concerned, which is typically 160 to 170. Uh, these are 200. So boom, uh, the Nike Air Max 97 OA on air, um, and it says GS. Oh, I thought it was supposed to be QS, but um, the color is black, reflective silver. Right. Uh, this is a men's 12, which is a women's 13 and a half. Style code is CI 1503001. And um, this is the Neon, the Soul. So it's uh, the 12 key cities for Nike, which they discussed in the um, their big investors day back in 2017. They talked about their 12 uh, key cities. And what they're doing is making sure that the 12 key cities are represented via um, fans of the brand. So they're letting those people design shoes. And it's a really cool kind of situation to see. And... Um, UPC for the size 12 is 193-150-474-514. This is 16 at the end. So let's open it up and see if we have our QC sticker and stamp. And we do. We have both. And that's a good thing. So let's see what the QC sticker reads. QC pass uh, B-0. And that's a new one. And the uh, stamp is 02-22-19-02. The paper has your key cities all over it and you see Paris, Tokyo you know New York City, London, Seoul Paris it's really dope man I mean the on-air collection is fantastic um, there should be a small card in here but I don't think the card is in this box and it's not so there's a card and it's a postcard, basically, that's supposed to be in the box. And there's no postcard in here. Um, pulling this out so we can get a quick look at the inside of the shoe. The insole. Right? And it's, like I said, it's the neon sole. And I'm going to pull. And sole, we're talking about a, a homonym. Seoul, as in S-O-U-L, and Seoul, as in Seoul, Korea right so we have that and you know the bullet train waves is perfect for Korea I guess for Asia actually but that may be me just overstepping there the aglets have the swooshes on the aglets are in the colors of the waves that are on the shoe so let's go to the back of it and check out that 0 2 19 02 19 and the production date these are made in Vietnam uh, small code is VT3 and um, the production date is 11 09 18 2 02 02 19 let's go ahead throw this paper back inside of it instead of leaving it out these are going to have to be wiped off actually because someone tried these on and the thing I hate about when someone tries something on inevitably there are problems but you can see that 3M how reflective it is and I've been having problems with 3M lately but the little bubble that's on the tongue on these on the left shoe it has sole it's a really dope pair of shoes man Nike makes these fantastic shoes and it seems that no one else can really make these shoes that become kind of collectors items in a sense and I, I really can't explain why that is but it's the reason Nike's a bigger company than everybody else they just take a lot of time to make sure they're doing it the right way now I'm moving that up because the back of it is just Air Max on the back and then there is a symbol on the back of that I want to move it up to see if you can see it get that in focus and then I'm going to wrap this up you can't really see it. It's not going to get in focus for some reason. There we go. And if somebody can leave a comment and tell me what that is, that'd be great. But that's it. I'm going to wrap this up and get this over with and move on to the next shoe because 
I've got a few shoes to do, including a Yeezy, which means it's going to take forever to do that video. Yeezys are always hard to look at for the first time. 